1529 forecast. Well, it's just a matter of time before our next snow arrives. Let's get right to it. a lot of weather to talk about. NBC 29's live Doppler radar shows it looks like it's raining, sleeting and snowing, but it is up in the clouds. It's not reaching the ground just yet. The atmosphere here at ground level is too dry to support the rain and snow to reach the ground, but that will change in a hurry later on this evening. It's snowing at an inch or two per hour from the capital city of West Virginia and Charleston down to Pikeville. Now the heaviest corridor of snow is going to stay to our northwest this go around. So for our area, we're going to get an inch or two up to four over, especially the higher elevations and over into the Blue Ridge Mountains. But we've had a, a, a season's worth of snow today in Nashville. They picked up more than five inches of snowfall out that way in a matter of a few hours, Lexington, Kentucky as well. So uh, this entire system is pushing eastbound. Now there's some drier air pushing in across South Side Virginia. So it's not too far away as you head south of the James River. There's not going to be any accumulation. We'll talk about that in a moment, but winter weather for the entire area, well, except for Buckingham County, because Buckingham County, you're going to be around the edge of snow versus no snow, really. But for much of the area, there's a winter weather advisory from late tonight into tomorrow morning and the winter storm warning for the high country of the Blue Ridge. So let's take a look at it hour by hour. Our future cast shows maybe a little brief rain and sleet at the onset at 9 p.m. Here's 11 midnight snow, heavy at times, heavy snowfall. That's going to be the peak of it at midnight. And then by 2, 3 a.m., it's out of here. Sunshine returns for tomorrow afternoon with no new accumulation. Now our, our global forecast models for Charlottesville show anywhere from an inch and a half to four inches of snow. So there's a pretty wide spread there. And in Stanton in the Shenandoah Valley, your global forecast models are showing anywhere from say uh, two and a half, three up to almost five. So our forecast model. This is the high res model that updates constantly. It's showing in general two to three inches for Charlottesville east of the Blue Ridge, Central Virginia, so not nearly as much as what we had on Monday. It will be a wet snow, but this is not enough to bring down a lot of trees or power lines. So that's certainly some good news. It's also not, not going to be quite as wet, not as much moisture content in the snowfall like we had on Monday. Four to eight over the higher elevations and three to four, maybe five in portions of the valley. But look at that sharp cutoff. Roanoke, Lynchburg, south towards Farmville and near the Richmond Metro may not get any accumulation overnight. Much colder for tomorrow night, low single numbers and teens with refreezing world K on Saturday. Our next system arrives on Sunday in the form of rain and not snow this go around. Overnight tonight, lows will be in the 20s and teens by daybreak with a quick one to four on average. For tomorrow, the snow's gone. Cold sunshine with a brisk breeze. Watch for slick travel in the morning. And then your seven day forecast shows us a cold night tomorrow night with refreezing. 30s on Saturday with chilly sunshine and a chance of rain later Sunday with highs in the 40s and overall a quiet weather pattern next week.